Okay. okay. G'day, Nathan. How are you? Okay, Gene. How are you, mate? All right? Yeah, yeah, good. Thank you, mate. Mate, ha how did you find the, the surface? Oh, the surface is really good. Uh, it's probably, probably a little bit firm, um, obviously, because they uh, play polo on there and, uh, you know, it's uh, probably a little bit uh, bumpy in, in bits and pieces, but um, no, generally it's uh, quite a nice oval. The uh, grass is uh, yeah, quite nice. Does it feel like a pretty ground with the temporary stands? Uh, yeah, it does actually, yeah. They've, uh, they've got a few stands uh, on the uh, outside wing and then um, obviously got a, uh, a few uh, areas that are media and stuff like that. So, um, uh, it, it, uh, you know, the backdrop's probably not a, a general, uh, you know, city for a um, footy ground, but um, no, it does, does feel uh, pretty similar to a ground once you're on there. And Nathan, are you playing? Yes, yeah, I'll have a, I'll have a run around, mate. Now, Craig has been very open. He's telling us exactly where guys are playing. Are you playing forward or back? Um, at this stage, I'm, I'm not sure. We'll uh, probably have a meeting <laughs> this afternoon. Um, so, yeah, been, been doing a bit of training throughout the pre-season at both ends. And, uh, yeah, this stage, we'll probably find out later on tonight. Now, 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 Nathan, more importantly, how's that body of yours? What sort of conditions is, is, is that body in? Because you're, you're a very important cog. Sorry, say again? Your body, the condition, how is it? Oh, pretty good, pretty good. I haven't uh, really missed much training at all uh, during the pre-season. I, um, I had that uh, hip surgery in the off-season. Um, and, that, and yeah, since, since that, I've, I've come back uh, really well. It hasn't given me any trouble at all. So, now the body's uh, feeling pretty good. Um, we had a recovery week uh, a couple of weeks ago. So, um, yeah, that was, uh, that was much needed from the, the sort of solid training that we have been doing up until then. But, um, so at the moment, uh, the body's feeling really good and, and roaring to go. No, good on you, mate. Hip, hip surgery, hip surgery sounds so serious. Uh, what do they actually do? Yeah, you know, it does, does sound pretty serious. And, uh, generally when you tell people, they're, they're pretty shocked. And, uh, um, and then when you tell them sort of the, uh, turnaround time for the recovery, they're, they're even more shocked. But, um, no, I had uh, just a bit of cartilage damage uh, in the, uh, the label itself, which is the capsule uh, around the, the ball and socket joint in your hip. Um, so yeah, they just they go in through a uh, keyhole and uh, and uh, yeah, just tidy up the cartilage and um, yeah, you're back on your feet within probably a day or two, and then um, probably about four to six weeks uh, without running. But um, yeah, after that, uh, I was yeah pretty much. Uh, straight back into training, so it was only about a four to six week uh, turnaround from, from when I had it to uh, when I was back into full training. So that lets you work on that massive body of yours to do, the, do, your, do your weights rather than running? Yeah, yeah, just, uh, just stay in the gym and uh, play swimming and, uh, and upper body stuff, so that was good. Beautiful. <laughs> well, mate, look, good luck. Thanks for having the chat.